हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू क्लास वन आई एम मिस एनरिन इन टूडेज क्लास वी विल स्टडी ऑन द टॉपिक एडिंग जीरो एंड सब्ट्रैक्टिंग जीरो इट इज़ वेरी सिंपल एंड इजी टू अंडरस्टैंड सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ एडिंग जीरो एडिंग जीरो टू एनी नंबर डज नॉट चेंज द टोटल The answer will remain same. Zero means empty or nothing. So, for example, there are three cupcakes in one plate, and there is nothing in another plate. So, how much will be in total? That is three. So, three plus zero is equal to three. Understood? So if we add zero with any number the answer will remain same Now let's do addition in vertical order using zero First question we have 7 plus 0 the answer will be 7 Question number 2 3 plus 0 the answer will be 3 Question number three, zero plus seven, the answer will be seven. Even if we write zero above and any number below, then also the answer won't change. Question number four, zero plus one, that is one. Now let's understand the concept of subtracting zero. Subtracting zero from any number gives us the same number. The answer will be remain same. For example, there are seven flowers in a pot, and in the other there is nothing, which means empty. So the answer will be the same number, because there is nothing to subtract. Understood? So subtracting zero from any number gives us the same number. So seven minus zero is equal to seven. Now let's do in vertical order. Question number one, that is four minus zero is equal to four. Second question, seven minus zero, the answer is seven. Question number three. Six minus zero, the answer is six. Question number four, one minus zero, the answer is one. Now I hope you understood the concept of adding zero and subtracting zero. Do practice at your home daily. Thank you. Stay home and stay safe.